close this evening. I want to thank everybody for sharing. I think we all knew Mark in different ways. We encountered him in different places. And each encounter was a little bit different. And so hearing family and friends, and people that encountered him all throughout the community, you get a really nice, wonderful, complete picture, or more complete picture of Mark. And uh, how much he meant to this community. He was a fixture. And while he's not with us physically any longer, his spirit will live on in all of those lives that he's touched. And I know there's a lot more people that wanted to be here tonight that could not be here. Watching, reading the stuff on Facebook was just amazing. There were hundreds of, of posts uh, of people that could not be here because they're out of the area. They don't live here anymore. But they all remember Mark and they had nothing but wonderful things to say about him. And uh, so, so family, thank you very much for sharing it with us uh, in the community. And as we go forward, we carry that memory of Mark with us. And as Jill said, um, we can be transformed by that. We have different encounters with God. And I, have, I think that Mark was one of those encounters with God that is supposed to transform us. And the fact that we're all here speaks to that. And so now it's up to us to take Mark's spirit and that friendship and that joy that we always have and spread that to the community in his honor, in his name, in his memory. And I think we'll all grow, we'll all be a little bit better. Thank you. 